Hello, hello everyone. Um, I just see my come up quick. Uh, for that can vent out me the satisfaction on how things go today, how it unfold in our ball. We just want for, on behalf of FC Calon and the fans of FC Calon, um, I just want for condemn the act of violence because obviously we know say we for the preach and practice fair play when it comes to football. Even though we always think say we get something on the line for loss, we everybody go into that pitch, they want for go win. And uh, you know, say sensitivity they on the line, emotion, emotions they on the line, the passions they on the line and all. But um, we just want for condemn the act in, uh, at the end of the day. Um, yes, in football, everything happen. I mean, fuckers happen, mistakes happen, um, mistakes for more officiating. These are all part of the game, they make football beautiful. But one thing we'll for always think about, say, we are families, we are brothers and sisters. At the end of the game, everybody go back and practice brotherhood. So, I know who they, who they feel for your lives in the salon. Say, yes, we emotions and then they up to that level where they caused by the passion and all. But during the game, as you go into the process, you for no say, we are brothers and sisters then. And whatever get for happen, no look after each other and they will learn for coexist with each other. Now, um, I appeal to the Bow Rangers executive, the chairman, Wena Babadi. Yes, I apologize on behalf of we supporters that we did not go on because we did condemn that act day of violence for even vandalize the stadium. When we own stadium, all they intend for play, international match, other games they will go for play day. And then we they condemn the act of Bow Rangers fans as well. We go destroy FC Calon and Boss, try for for hot the players them and all all are you know good and not call for because at the end of the day we are brothers and sisters. We game done after two minutes. I mean everything done, everything go back to normal and then we move on for the next day. But uh, I mean we think they happen now bow now bow right now. I uh, mean we just want for join and with the bow rangers executive. Low we go back now hospital because we get five or six or seven people away damage, seriously damaged. We get woman them we broke them the hand they wouldn't broke their hand them. And we for go look after them, mostly say me they're okay. Then from there, whatever goes for happen, the PLB day, not the one in the league. I mean, they have free associations there. They um they have the officiating team where they they will come up with a match report because since I watched the game, I watched the entire game and I see exactly all what happen. Um, as I can always say in a salon, we know for the duel on for things that we not even important, like salon. Football, we're not getting nothing for win. Like he always says, we're not getting nothing for win at this point until we prepare the platform for the next 20 years, 30 years. Then we'll go begin win something. If you go win champion, we're not getting nothing. You don't even know up to today, we don't know what's inside the cup. We don't know who they play for. We don't know who they get for relegate. We don't know almost how many teams get for relegate. We don't know how many teams get for go Champions League for go represent the country. We don't know almost inside the trophy. So we're who they play for. We're who they win at the end of the day. Okay, pass. We wound yourself. We hurt yourself. We disrespect yourself. I mean, for me, not only for win. So we need for fix the little things that must they say all the time. Look at the pitch of the Bow Rangers. The Bow Rangers, Bow Rangers them pitch today. It's unplayable. So these are little things that we have for fix. We have for build the infrastructure. We have for make sure say all the things that are around the country there. They all don't date to standard. Then we begin prepare now for competition now for say okay. We want to compete with each other, for challenge each other, so we improve. So we get a lot of players that we can play for the national team because the competition normally may possibly develop. But if you're not prepared for competition, I want to play competition. Yes, so then what thing have for happen? Because then I mean like from my own side, my objective always now we fans them way, we don't get I mean serious amount of fans them way. Um, we don't want to disappoint, and uh, you know the essence of playing football. Obviously, not for win, for win titles and all. But you get for win titles the the right way. Yeah, you get for winning the right way, and you get for be a process. We almost club in a salon we don't reach the professional standard. Even FC Cologne, we don't reach professional standard yet because we're not even able to take care of players then. We're not able to take care of players then for sustainable players then. Pay them adequately or pay them sufficiently when they go for take care of themselves and live a better life. It's impossible. Yeah, if you think about say the Bamo declaration and the requirements within set for every Premier League club, we know able for having made that that's it. But we still claim say we want play professional football and we want win titles and we want fetch each other, we want damage each other. I don't think so to reach that level there even. Yeah, because almost in the Nasalo we're able to forget a youth system going on. 
from under 6 to under 18. Okay, when a part of the Bible declaration. Then they say you forget a playing field, then you forget a secretariat, then you forget a playing stadium. Playing stadium, I always rule them out because that is impossible. Not only because, I mean, the Baba, the, I mean, think or in thought alone, me for build stadium, like, bro, then a blessing to me. How many thousands of people who don't get in a salon, we don't go through what that means, them, we don't make money in a salon, we don't go build houses, them, and mansions, they overseeing and everything put in a salon. So, how many of we will get over $1 million to go build stadium? It's impossible, it's unrealistic. Nobody knew for that. For go put seven, ten thousand, ten million dollars in a big stadium, it's, in, it's unrealistic, it's impossible. So now if we think about the little, little things them, how we for come together as I mean brothers and sisters, and then uh, move the game forward. Because I don't know get for develop the game. But by the end, brother, all the Bow Rangers fans and uh, and officers them and uh, the executive, the all who all are brothers and sisters, we joke, we laugh, we play. I just talked to Baba this a few minutes ago. So you see, we all want the good for the game. We want for help for develop the game. But we get for control. We fans them. I mean, educate them properly what the game is about. The game is about win. You lose, you draw sometimes. So what's in happening in that field today? Yes, we're not going to talk about what's in trigger the actions of the supporters and, um, and what's in happening at the end of the day. Yes, because if you go into that, you can begin to talk about I mean, uh, the, the, the incidents that were happening in the game will trigger the emotions of the of the fans that will lead to that. But the only thing what they say, football is supposed to be structured properly and run properly in the country. If the Premier League board, they run a league, then get for structure the league properly. Then get for get ambulances we get for the end of the field, then get for get adequate securities around the field. Then, around the field, then inside the perimeter fence, policemen know for the inside perimeter fence, all gone. You know, get no nothing for today. I don't play that Europe how many years. I don't want to see police policemen inside the field is gone. One day I don't want to see policemen. Now, Salon no more, they see game, they play policeman, they inside field. If the referee call, make a call, na wrong call, left the players them inside the field, let the referee deal with them. Obviously, if I the play, me na captain of my team, referee call, eh? or he do injustice, when he think, say, not to the right call he make, I'd go meet the referee. Yes, yeah, sometimes I go be ag aggressive, sometimes I go be lenient, sometimes I go go talk directly to the referee. So if five players, seven players, eight players, of any team, go surround that referee day, even the Champions League or the World Cup, what did the referee get for do? Now the referee, now you get the game, now get the last decision. So the referee, as you pull one yellow card and show one person, or one red card, everybody don't run away. But what here happened in the game we may see today, where for me not call for, we just get for set to let do things, then they way they bother with football. The referee call for penalty. I don't want to defend now, asking not to penalty or not to penalty or not penalty, or in the incident the way it happened throughout the game. This is left to the Premier League board, because for me, if even they give Boeing just 10 points or they win the game 10-0, it don't make no difference to me because at the end of the day, FC Calon for merit every victory. If FC Calon they win trophy, they for merit and they for deserve. The players they for challenge themselves and go home and do their assignment them and prepare themselves properly for win game. So if they get a fake call, a penalty, then the players them, yeah, we clearly go to the referee for go protest, say, down they not to penalty. It will last for 30 seconds. Maybe 30 seconds, 20 seconds, like will last for. Then the guy go pull your card and show somebody, then everybody go away. Right? That's how it works. But if the policeman and can inside the field, immediately the player flip and deal with the players then, what in the policeman and can inside the field for? So the policeman and can inside the field go direct to the scene inside the field and go begin go pull the players there. Policeman not gonna write for church no player. Go check the rules and regulation of the game. You don't see policeman go pull church player and pull out. We don't get plenty of incidents to happen, even during the Champions League and all, even inside Fair not. The incident will happen in five minutes. Argue when they get free and the other team and fair not players there. No steward no can inside the field. No policeman no can inside the field. But if policeman can inside the field, go begin jump jump player. This all then the trigger. The emotions of the fans there from up there when they go begin to go something. And they defend them because I was say I don't condemn the act of violence already. For me, there is no in any shape or form violence for the pan football. But now the things then will lead to that. So now I make me not talk about the technical things that will happen in the game. Would I play passing company? Would I get in, would I get uh, 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 edge for win the game or not win the game? No. And they talk about the incident where they happen now. We don't hospitalize five or ten people from FC Cologne, and I don't know the amount of people who were damaged back from Bougainville because if two persons they fight, obviously both parties get for get hurt along the line. So now I make me the appeal to the Bougainville fans, um, fans, and FC Cologne fans. Meaning, calm down, 
They don't do enough football. It's off. It's over. Let everybody just calm down and not continue the fight anymore. The one they don't damage during the hospital, I mean, I'd expect say the boy just guys them. Yes, I'm not saying that's not mad with the situation at all, but please, when I go to the hospital, let go check on them. Those they say they're all okay until they make their way in Africa. Because we're not brothers and sisters, anyways. Football is done today, tomorrow we carry on. The game not done already. We're not going to play ball just again. We're done, done. Then we'll move forward. It's up to Premier League board now. Whatever decision they want to make, that's up to them. It's up to them. But um, as I say, I don't want to stay longer um, on live because um, a lot of things going on right now. And <laughs> I don't get a lot of we follow as them who don't come up. They ask me why me could they come up and all and all. All man get assignments they now for do. Uh, the poor Parker is mean busy. He can mean you know go before come online now and we'll get a little bit tired, engage with the national team and also we we'll defend special time then we can give an updates on the development. Let's just developments the way they go right here in the salon. This is the national team engaging in um in Turkey. They play they normally play two games already, the first game. First, first, first half was brilliant, fantastic. You don't see new players that we don't come in, young players them. Oh, I can talk about when are some of who please the nan and they will be the make on this program saying that we want to tap the young player them with the undecisive or the or and the indecisive. Because if you go miss player on 21, 25, 26, in the night it gets big hope and it don't make up a mind already say I want to play for the big dogs then because we salon we could compete with England when it comes to player. Obviously, England will win. Italy go win, all the nations go win. So now we tap the players them where they still they listen to them, pay against them, so we we'll convince them and they can play to we like what's not happening now with the Camille. I'm very happy for see Camille, I'm very happy for see Jonathan, I'm very happy for see I mean the Bellies, I mean the other young young one that we come in the squad. Yeah, I know say I mean the future is bright. And uh and I know say in the next few years early on we don't get a competitive team based on the young players they all get. Lost year we for manage them and blend them into the to the system because what i say always now say if you tap the players then when they're young huh, then you're able to change the mentality you're able to bring them into the culture and with tradition because with culture mind you the one that we born in a salon obviously they know exactly what it takes half of going to them now that we try for build we own culture back again and bring come into act then we get for fit for make the one them way born overseas when they come in for long we able for make them get used to the culture very very quick so at least we can for get a, a very good blend and because mind you African football is different from European football the football they play in England and the football they play in Africa is completely different it's completely different yeah yeah it's more of I mean compactness individual individual ability uh would I want her more would I determine more would I prepare more would I Athletical more, I mean, with a physical more, so it's different. Not like a Europe where everything programmed, everything prepared. So, man, but I'm happy for seeing a lot of young faces and new faces coming in. Anyway, so now uh, some of the things I don't want to say, and I uh, apologize again on behalf of FC Calon. I mean, the, the incident when I see today, everybody go tell, go stand say now we now one of the most disciplined club in the salon. We know they ever protest and fit. They don't take advantage many, many, many times. So now I make like even me quitting of I mean competing for the trophy for many, many years. Now because of the too much advantage, the too much politics into football. As you that person they there against you, or you there against them, or you tell them the truth, they don't go against you. Then whenever they see you club, they go victimize you, then go make sure they go against you for frustrate you and all. So we don't see all that. So um we don't see all that, but um we're not go we're not gonna be limited to that, we'll just continue mean for persevere and hope say the better days are coming so for the incident we happened today we condemn the act of we fans them we vandalize the stadium and then we condemn the act as well um for bow rangers fans we go i mean vandalize with bosses and everything so i mean we just pray say all the one they were up to hospitalized i mean then get a speedy recovery and go get the medicine so at least they will come back very very strong and continue for follow football then we left everything to the premier league board in the SLFA, and uh, from the match report, and I mean, whatever I get for coming, mm. yeah. Because this relivery time, as I say, is part of the game, is the beauty of the game. The referees, I mean, the officiating team, I mean, the course, them when they make, yes, I watched the game. Yeah, I see the two four stuff like five, six yards offside, obviously, we're not called, but then they all this, I mean, it's explainable, I mean, it's expectable because at the end of the day, football, if you don't make mistakes, then the game didn't sweep that much. But the thing with me, they condemn is. Policeman not for going inside field. No, no business for the inside field. Policeman, 
where they are free game done you go protect the referee and take the referee out of the field but the game not go there in progress the referee call a call for an infringement or whatever i call for players they go protest to the referee where the referee able for deal with the players them able for deal with the players those card able for caution them able for talk to them able for manage the situation if you come to the worst the fourth man go go inside the field if you come to the worst the match commissioner go go inside the field but not to police police don't go inside the field and go trigger the situation and all these other things then come up yeah so me you not know, they defend the act of we play as them or the supporters them we vandalize the stadium or we do that act say we condemn the act FC Kalanoa for associate themselves with violence because we stand for um for development we want for help the beginning for develop we want for help players them for develop we want for educate them the right way and give them the opportunity for play football so in that regards we say sorry so the Bow Rangers executive, the Bow Rangers fans, and everybody we present in that stadium day for see FC Calon fans put on that act day. We are very, very sorry. And up to now, we don't get the actual story yet, but just seeing in from the from the from the footage on Facebook, you know, decent for for C. I mean fans of FC Calon and players of FC Calon day into that action day. I think say so. we condemn that act day and um, we apologize. I mean bluntly, bluntly on um, on Facebook, on everywhere, and I hope say my message could meet all the representatives of uh, Bow Rangers and the fans of football that we do such a to save from violence and we appeal to we fans to men and calm down, men and take them easy. The game is done. Whatever decision in the Premier League board or SLF you get for make for me, I always tell and say football development now we care about we have to get a lot of players them a lot of create a lot of talents them educate a lot of talents them develop a lot of talents them way we we'll get overseas trade we fc calon go able for make money for able for develop with team and turn with team into a professional team as i said before no team not as alone a professional team because we're not even able for take care of we self as a team we never sustain we self as a team so we're too well for win we we'll not get that team for win league they play up to now in the middle of the league how many games left? We don't know what to the play for. We don't know most things the trophy. We don't know how many teams get for relegate. We don't know how many teams get for represent the country. So wait till they win. So but sometimes we we are talking to my fans there, my fans they say, but West Carolina win the camp championship, they don't want this, they don't want that. But it's clearly easy for C because at the end of the day, we get a proper system running already. Alex if FC Calon lost 12 players, 10 players, we still them for compete. And teams don't think that's a little better pass we in terms of technical technique technical, tactical, and physical. Yes, team no not better pass with you. Yeah, so if you want to go into argument on performances and all, even Lions, the Golden Scope is five years of side Scope Awards, but you never see anybody come on social media and can comment. I watch the game, I get the clip and everything, it's five years of side. But we accept that, we accept the results and move forward. The two of side way, Bowen just gets even at five years and seven years. If they score, no problem, we'll clap for them because the officiating team, not see them, are we see them. So if you call for them, then that's fine. So for me, I just want to stop here and say thanks to everybody. Sorry, guys, I'm not going to answer questions and um, I don't prepare for that today. Yes, definitely I'll come in, uh, I will come online back inside this week. I mean, for Kangi, there's so many things we have to talk about. Definitely I want to talk about the national team because something positive is coming, is happening. And uh, seeing all these great, talented young players coming in into our national team, I think is a great prospect. And uh, the future is bright. Yes, we get a um, lot of I mean, uh, victims in the way they hospital right now. We are hospitalized. I um, mean, I make a say, are they rich? Just I mean, send the olive branch to Bow Rangers. I don't say yes. They say vex right now. They're mad at the situation. Everything that happened. But it's the game. That's a football day. Your emotions can take you somewhere. But after the game, everybody can come down back and begin look at the border there now. Because even when what would they play before? I they play against Kemokai. I they play against Musa. My own blood border them. When the game not start, I don't even care about them. I don't care who that them be. 
he was then I go tell any kind of word, I go play any kind of way. But after the game, you get to come back to say, okay, he's my brother, my brother, we practice brotherhood and move forward. So I know they go understand that. We just get to go back and go look after all the victims them, the Borgangers fans them way hot, and the FC Cannon fans them way hot as well, or make sure say everybody okay. Let them just squeak because it take a lot of time, FC Cannon a lot of time for them to get off the stadium. But we have to say thanks to some of the players them of Borgangers, the Musa Tumbo, the uh, Kosombo, um, Kasim to where where you go um, IB computer we go try for rescue the players them and then find a way out. That's how it, that's how it, it should be because I don't know the day we all our brothers and we all our brothers and sisters them into this sport. So now we go for practice the fair play to the field where you study field everybody everybody in a lion because well, everybody want for win anyways. But after the game we we'll just practice the fair play and then move things on. Thank you very much guys. Over the weekend I will come in again. I can continue. I mean some of we get a lot of information stem for gear anyways with latest developments in football i mean uh, female football don't launch the the uh, the female premier league board don't launch they don't constitute them and they don't launch them already where i think they got about nine or ten female uh, members them in that is in that um board day and then from there the national team development as well I mean, they talk here right now so i don't know still again next game i think it's on tuesday or so so probably tuesday or wednesday we go come online back and can't care for going our statistics of everything that happened around Sierra Leone football. Thank you very much, guys. Bye. Peace.